I'm going to walk you through a new app called Click Social that incorporates a couple of elements. The Click web connectors, creating apps on demand, and social media. I'll go ahead and launch the Click Social app creation part. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and pick Twitter as a data source and tell the API I want to pull back 10 pages of tweets. And that's a 100 tweets a page, so a total of 1,000 tweets. I'll also include some Reddit data, which is an open community discussing a ra range of topics. Now, I'll go ahead and add a keyword here. I'll go ahead and search for click and see what people are saying about click on social media. So when I click on the search button, the um, application will call the Click APIs, instantiate a new app. It will set up data connections using our web connectors to connect to the Twitter API, as well as the Reddit API. And set a load script for me, go ahead and reload the application and pull in the data for me to analyze. Once the reload is going, it will finish eventually and then go ahead and save the application and take me to the analysis view. So I'll just wait for a couple of seconds for this uh, load to finish and then let me show you what the output looks like. Okay, so here I'm looking at my click social analytics view. So you can see up here is the keyword that I search for, click. I have a search bar to filter the result uh, additionally. I have a view on the right hand side around the users who have posted a lot around this topic, what are some of the common hashtags. On the left we have a navigation pane. We can look at some of the popular hashtags, which source of data we're looking at and filter on certain users. And in the middle here I have a flow of, of tweets and Reddit posts uh, regarding to this topic sorted by uh, time. So if I scroll down a little bit. I see I have a scatter chart here showing um, posts from users depending on how many followers they have and how many status updates they do. So people here on the far right are people with a lot of followers and the kind of the heavy influencers in these topics. And people up here around the top um, are probably bots that are retweeting a lot of stuff and just following certain accounts. And below here we have some of the users who are mentioned a lot, uh, what time of the day that some of these posts are being uh, posted. So let's go ahead and filter on a few of these users here and look at some of those tweets in more detail. So what are people tweeting about Click? We have a couple of posts here. It seems to be a lot around the Euro 2016. <laughs> Click is tweeting about baby names. Interesting. Let me go ahead and take a look at that post on Twitter. I'll just click on it and it pops right up. go back to my application. So let's search for Euro and select all the tweets that are related to Euro 2016. We can look at them. Okay, so there's a, oh, you can predict the winner between different days. Okay, that's great. So basically what Click Social is, it, it's an app that allows you to create a social media analytics app on the fly for whatever topic you want. And then go ahead and sort of explore those results a bit. And it allows you to take those kind of snapshots in time. So it adds my search here to my list at the bottom. I can go ahead and remove them and throw them away when I don't want them. But whenever anything significant happens, say Brexit, for example, I took a snapshot of that um, back on July 1st. I can go ahead and go back and revisit that and look at what people were saying and who were the very influential people uh, tweeting about it. So it's a great way to have a little collection of kind of social media lightweight apps around specific topics uh, in time. Thank you so much for listening.